Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome to the second day of my five ingredient or less recipe series. If you missed yesterday's video, yesterday's theme was chicken so I will leave that video in the iCards and also in the description box below. Make sure you go check it out because it was so so delicious and I would hate for you guys to miss it. And just like yesterday's video, this video is in collab, but today it is in collaboration with my friend Llewellyn from Savvy Coupon Shopper. If you guys love saving money, couponing, Dollar Tree, and all of that stuff, definitely check out her channel. She does weekly Target, CVS, and Walgreens couponing, as well as a Dollar Tree haul every single Wednesday. So make sure you go over to her channel. I will leave it in the description box below. And check out her channel and let her know that I sent you because I would love for her to get some love from you guys because she definitely deserves it because she saved so many people so much money so thank you again Llewellyn for agreeing to collab with me in this series and now let's get into today's recipe so today's theme is turkey and I chose to use ground turkey now if you're not new to my grocery hauls and meal plans you probably assume that this recipe was going to be during this week at some point and you would be correct this is my turkey taco bowls as you can see from the picture I absolutely love these things I put them on the meal plan about once every two weeks or more than that if that's what we're feeling for that week and we absolutely love them so a little disclaimer before I start this may seem like it's more than five ingredients because technically it is but I chose not to include the toppings in the five ingredients because those are up to your discretion and you can cater those based to what your family likes I am making this with cilantro lime rice so the five ingredients that are kind of the base of it are rice cilantro lime turkey meat and taco seasoning and the rest of the things you're going to see me add are either seasonings which don't get included in the five items or toppings which like I said I did not include for this time because they are up to you guys of what you like on your regular tacos. Now this recipe is very similar to regular tacos. The first thing I'm going to do is brown this ground turkey. Of course you could use ground beef or ground chicken or wherever you really wanted to use but I prefer it with ground turkey. So I am going to add salt and pepper that you see in these little owl salt and pepper shakers and some garlic salt. I love to do this even before I put taco seasoning just because I think it adds a lot of flavor because ground turkey can sometimes lack a little bit of flavor. So next thing I'm going to do is add the taco seasoning mix. This was a really big pack from Trader Joe's so I did not end up adding the whole thing but you can just add as much as you want or as little as you want as well. Then I'm going to cut up some cilantro, some red onion, and some tomatoes. The cilantro is for the rice and the tomatoes and the red onions are just for toppings. So you can see that I have chopped up all of these and again you can do them as thick or as thin as you want the pieces to be. And then I just wanted to show you this because I think that these three next to each other are absolutely beautiful. So I just wanted to show that quick clip of them. And now we are going to get on to the rice. So I already pre-cooked this rice and I'm just going to add some cilantro and some lime to it. I think this gives this dish a lot more flavor than just having regular rice. Sometimes I do skip this but I just know that when I don't skip it, it's so much better. So I'm going to mix this really, really well and then just heat it throughout so I can make sure all the flavors kind of marry together so I can start assembling them into these turkey taco bowls. Okay, now that all the individual pieces are done, I'm going to put it all together. So I'm going to start with just layering some rice on the bottom. Again, you can do as much or as little of any of these things as you want. But I'm just going to put a couple of scoops of rice on the bottom. And then I'm going to come in and add our ground turkey that has all those seasonings in it to marry with the cilantro and lime. And it's going to be so delicious. So then I'm going to go through, sorry my hand is in the way, I'm going to go through and add my toppings. I like red onions, tomatoes, and cheese as kind of like my base. Sometimes I do switch it up and do other things, but for the most part, this is typically how I make mine because it is so, so good. So then I'm going to go in and add just regular sharp cheddar cheese. Again, I would like to have had the Mexican blend cheese, but we didn't have any today, so that will just have to do. 
So next I'm going to do is add some sour cream and this squeeze container makes it so much easier for regular tacos and for this you can see we're running out so my squirter thing did not work like it was supposed to but then this Taco Bell hot sauce is the absolute key. I absolutely love this stuff and I think it is so so good and we used to get the individual packets from Taco Bell but then we found that they had this in the store so we didn't have to do all that. So again I just kind of drizzle some of that on the top and that is how I assemble my bowls guys. This meal is so good and it's so versatile and you can make it for whoever and cater to their taste. So I just think that those colors just look beautiful together. I did end up adding a little bit of cilantro on top but that is it guys. So make sure you subscribe if you have not already and go check out Llewellyn's video because I'm so excited to see what she has created with turkey. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow with a brand new recipe. Bye guys.